two Rowan University students are speaking out after they were pulled over by officers at gunpoint and the incident was all captured on camera. And now Glassboro police are also telling their side of the story that has sparked outrage on campus. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Davis has the new developments. Oh my God. It's dramatic cell phone video that captures the moment two Rowan University students were ordered to get out of their vehicle by Glassboro police with their weapons drawn. Cop car just pulls up behind us. We hear the siren. We were we actually thought it was for the car behind us. Rowan freshman Giovanna Robinson tells us she was in the car when Altif Hassan was ordered to get out. First I seen him pointing at Tief and I was like, Tief, they have a gun pointing at you. And I was like, oh my God. And I was like, and then I seen like other guns. Police say someone reported seeing a man pointing a gun at a black Dodge Charger. The man then got into the car and drove off. That's when police say they followed the Dodge Charger before stopping it at Rowan University. Never even crossed my mind to do anything like that because I, I'm, on, I'm on a mission. You know what I mean? Let's be frank. I'm here trying to get my education. According to police, they were just doing their job. Hassan tells us he feels like he was racially profiled and hopes this situation sparks a change. If you don't want to apologize, I understand, but at least feel, feel bad. Like, I really just put this kid through all of that, like, for no reason. It wasn't nothing. A university spokesperson tells us there will be an open discussion available to all students. They will be able to discuss race relations as well as how their communities are policed. We are told Glassboro police were invited to this discussion, but it's unclear whether or not they will be here. For now in Glassboro, I'm Kimberly Davis, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.